Ok. Secret passage marked on map. Press 2 or M to refuel. Uh, ok, wait. Where are we now? Are we here? In the sewing room? Ok. I need to go downstairs? Or no? Where do I need to go? Uh, it told me it was on my map, but... Oh wait! Duh! Okay. Um... So... Let's see... We are going on an adventure! To the secret fucking room. What is this? Oh yeah, let me read this first. Sam's dark room. Do not enter if red lights are on. Oh! Okay, so we don't going to enter then. Bye bye. We need to do something else anyway. There's a secret passage somewhere. Let me check the map. Okay, so we. Okay, I think it's there. Let's open panel. Oh my god, that is. Creepy. Turn on the light, please. Ghost Hunter Sam and Lonnie's secret house investigation log. Hidden compartment found. Three. Library, upstairs hall, and footer. Evidence of the supernatural discovered zero. The search continues. Okay, so there are panels with stuff behind it. Hidden components marked on map. Press two. Yeah, but I think we need to go here, right? Oh no. Oh my fucking god. Where, where am I? Okay, this is the um, the room of mom and dad. It's really fucking creepy. Those 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 thunders. Uh, let me see the map. Uh, where are we here? Uh, so there is panel. Oh, here. Nope, don't gonna fuck with that. Hello, hello. Who are you, Oscar? What do you want? I came PA. Uh -oh. Half of Samantha's locker combo added to backpack. Okay, so we. Okay, that's great. So, but uh, okay, we had that one, and the rest is downstairs. So we will take the shortcut. Close the door. If if we can, of course. Can we take the shortcut again? Yes, thank you very much. And close the door. Did I do that? Yes, I did that. Um, let me see. Uh, so, if we... Um, oh no. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I need, I need to position myself here. Okay, so you enter here and then go... Okay, I know where it is, I think. It's over here, somewhere. No, it's not. Oh yes, it is. Oh my God, that looks creepy. Mrs. Fitz. Oh my God, that looks fucking creepy. At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. 
The lights went out. I was turned toward her. My eyes started to adjust. And then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over. I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me and was so close and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head and I really hope she could tell. I really hope that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. Wow. Okay. So she, um, so Lonnie also likes her. That's good for her. Uh, let me see. Um, okay. It's over. Oh yeah, you can see it. I think this one, right? Yes. Bah. Heaven at the edge of the world. Private. Do not read. The Green Glacier Part 2. Samantha Greenbrier, 9th grade. So it's private, so we're gonna read it. Nope, we're not gonna read it because it's private. So, um, what was it again? Okay, and then we can put those two. Oh, you already did that. Poverty of Sam Private. Okay, I, I really cannot read that properly. Uh, where was her room again? Oh, yeah. I know again. Oh, let's break into her cabin closet thingy. Okay. Um, let me see that number one more time, please. Zero five zero one. Zero five zero one. Open. Oh, cool. Ooh, who's that? Is that Lonnie? Ooh. Lonnie came over today. But everything was different. She was sitting at my desk chair and she wouldn't look at me. Finally, I asked her what was going on. She said she felt like she'd done something wrong that night in the city. Like I must think. But I said no. There was nothing wrong. I just wanted to say. But I couldn't find the words. I felt like I was gonna cry, but I wasn't sad. She got up and sat next to me on the bed. I looked at her. Lonnie. Do you think you could ever... And that's when she kissed me. <laughs> <laughs> wow nice move Lonnie <laughs> nice move but uh, I think this uh, is an empty pack of cigarettes I won't tell mommy and daddy else uh, Samantha will be pissed I get okay gentlemen in a lady's locker okay so she is definitely into girls and not into guys so we found the key for the basement so we are going to the basement i guess so let's enter the ba basement i don't wanna by the way but oh my god why is it always dark everywhere Everywhere darkness. I hope we don't gonna find something weird over here. I don't like weird stuff. Actually I do. Chips! Oh, dear Samantha, I would like to cordially thank you for having me to your oh, bowl for the 
Thanksgiving holiday with your lovely family. I enjoyed the flavorful potatoes and also it was weird being around your parents for that long. But it was pretty funny. How impossible it is for your dad not to be awkward for more than 30 seconds at a time. Very cordially yours, your close friend and confident Lonnie D. Dear Mrs. De Soto, allow me to take this opportunity to thank you in kind for being such a glorious host of the festivities at your father's estate following the former mentioned meal with my parents your family's thanksgiving feast was the more enjoyable of the two events i must say i especially appreciated the time i spent with your grandmother who is a lovely woman with sterling taste and a refined air let's do it again sometime next year shall we indeed madam samantha greenbrier esg i think okay so that uh, is uh so they had uh, thanksgiving together and that's uh, samantha and lonnie it's different now I mean, we still hang out all the time like before. But now when no one else is around... Well, you know. So you could say we're dating. But it's secret. Secret dating? I don't know. I mean, I guess that's the real difference. Now when we get off the phone, or go home for the night, or it's just quiet and we're alone. We say I love you. They are dating! Woohoo! This is definitely a, a love story. Wow, that's creepy. Uh, I want to turn this light on, please. Thank you very much. What is this on? Uh, first, what's this? A worksheet. Nothing of interest. K is for kind. A is for amazing. E is for intelligent, T for talent, L is for light-hearted, E is for important, and N is What was that? Okay, now I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's not the rain. It's something else. Maybe it's the furnace? It's making a creepy sound though. Um, whoever lied here, I would... Oh yeah, thank you very much. I know there is a letter over there. We will uh, get that very shortly. But I want to know if I'm fucking safe. Before I go anywhere, and why is there a light on? Okay. Let's just close the door for now. Okay, let's read. What is this? Okay, so in short... I'm so stupid sometimes. I was telling Lonnie that I got into my college summer program thing. And I was all making plans like, you should come visit me, stay in my dorm room. But she said, Sam, I ship out on June 6th. I was like, ship out? To where? She said, to basic training. What did you think I was doing all that ROTC stuff for? I guess she's been planning to join the army right after high school since she was like 12. And I guess she's really going to do it. So I was like, after graduation, I'm just never going to see you again? She said, 
Let's just have fun while we can. Jack it up.